Aoi, I got your funny magic juice. Yeah. You bashed Abdominal Hill and her friends, absolutely amazing. Friends also get back medicine. Can you give medicine to Dr. Medi for me? Do not tell him Bugo had been making other medicine himself. It's our little secret. Okay. Whatever you say. You must wait for the night time. What's poppin'? You brought me the medicine I ordered for Buko. Hmm, it seems different from the medicine you gave me recently. Maybe it's a new formula or something. Anyway, thanks for looking into it for me. I did it. I'm so amazing. I must go thank Buko for his con continued efforts. Be ordering from him again soon, you see. Hmm, I don't know if you should do that. But I mean... Okay. Now, we must speak to somebody known as Dobby Dobby. Uh, but where is Dobby Dobby, you might ask? Well, go to Prophecy Hut. Maybe, just maybe, we could know. Also, the quest we're about to do has uh, two pathways. I know the correct pathway to go, or actually the, there is no correct pathway, but the better pathway. See this uh, tiny knob on here? Dabe Dabe sitting on the end of the diving platform. Oh, I hate high places, but I must show courage and make the jump. Dabby Dabby? Dabby Dabby okay? Not okay! Not okay at all! But I still... Ooh. I have to jump otherwise I can't get married. That Dabby Dabby had nothing to worry about. Ricky just says her Freddy's Dabby Dabby. Ricky goes shaky at knees when I think about jumping her mirror. Jumping business is very strange. So it's not just Dabby Dabby. I knew other not, but I think the same. But I do not... But I... But if I do not jump, Dabby 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 will, will disown me. Sticky situation indeed. When Ricky jump, Ricky made Oka. Oka jump along with Ricky. But it's also important to know when to give up. Nothing must not throw life away to get squished at bottom. Cowardly Ricky speak the truth. Ricky not coward, meh. Then I will call it quits. Maybe it's too dangerous. I will only end up causing more pain for myself and others. I will tell Didi that Dabby Dabby is worth is a worthless not one. I bet you are having to marry useless Dabby Dabby. That is best thing to do. Wow. Uh, Didi, please forgive me. Dabby Dabby, look at yourself. Teeny Winnie Napa like you could never pre jump properly. Silly Billy Dabby Dabby. Well then. Soxy vision. Yeah. So Dabby Dabby going to jump, but he say he not want to. Very foolish Dabby Dabby. Quick, Ricky must tell Didi before he do something silly. Let's chat to a, a Didi. The, the thing uh, getting bigger. Also gonna jump off. Ooh. Into the water. Also, I just want to show something real quick. Uh, central. Where is this? I oh, guess right here. Where is Dobby Dobby? I oh, guess. You want to notice the uh, profile pictures right here, real quick. I believe they change after this quest. You are a DD. Friends, went to see Dabby Dabby? Something wrong? Can I help? Indeed. Dabby Dabby, I worked hard to get a kid no jog wrestle. I worked so hard, my fur all in tatters. But I too late, Dabby Dabby, gone forever. I will jump too. Jump to Dabby Dabby. Dabby Dabby, I will be with you soon. Man, these knop on side quests sure. We're getting dark. Kid no jog wrestle. That was Ricky was it. Need to gather some kid no jog wrestle. If I do, Puka will sell me some enlarging seaweed. With the seaweed, Dabby Dabby can jump off diving boards safely. But it's impossible for me to gather a kid no jog wrestle by myself. Well, you're in luck because I have the kid no jog wrestle. 
we need to go talk to Bugo. Who is not here because it's nighttime or nighttime and he comes out at a daytime. Change the time today. Now we shall go. Now we shall go. Stop, Pooko. <laughs> I smell like you know Dark Rizzle. How did friends manage to find it? I beat up enemies. I sell nourishing seaweed here. If you eat it along with a Kino Dark Rizzle, you get really large. Friends want some enlarging seaweed? Friends can have it for free because friends have Pooko. Pooko might, might find it hard to shift all this Kino Dark Rizzle anyway. Get the enlarging seaweed. Actually, Aditi said she wanted some enlarging seaweed. Dabi Dabi is looking for some to eat as well. Here, I'll just give it out to friends. Now we have this quest, which is what leads to our forked path. Who is bigger? Give the enlarging seaweed to Aditi or Dabi Dabi? That is the question. Let us head to the mysterious sanctuary to make our decision. So, can I even position the camera to be outside? No, I can't. Oh well. So, this quest has two end results. All dependent on who you give the enlarging seaweed to. You can give it to our boy Dobby Dobby up here. Or you can give it to Aditi. If you give it to Dobby Dobby, you will get three greens. And if you're talking to people, you'll get three yellows. If you give it to Aditi, you will get three yellows after talking to people, two greens, and a blue. So I want to give it to Aditi. If you want a nicer affinity chart. Douche. You are a deity, right? Right, 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 yes. Friends got a large seaweed and a kid no jog wrestle. Oh, 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 it smells so good. I just hit a little bit. Oh, 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 oh. What happened? I suddenly messed up no one. Of course, now Big Me should be able to catch Dobby Dobby. Dobby Dobby, have courage to jump to a DD. I'm going to jump now. C catch me properly, DD. Sploosh. Dobby Dobby safe because a DD caught him. Phew. Now Dobby Dobby, now Dada Pond Lalapa, leave Dobby Dobby alone. Now I mess up no one, but my bigness let me save my Dabby Dabby, so I'm very happy. I will stay in love forever. Amazing. We did it, and I believe now that uh, we have enlargificated a DD. I think her thing changed. It didn't seem like it did. DD has grown really big now, but now we can be together. Thank you, friends. Your kindness moves me. Dabby Dabby's jump was incredible. That it is so amazing. It was amazing, too. Thank you for everything, Ricky. I thought it best to try and jump on my own, but I realized that I needed my friend's help. Ricky realized that, too, when he jumped. No matter what you do, working together is best thing. Dabby Dabby learned good lesson. Going in, going it alone is dangerous. Being scaredy cat is so pitiful. You end up having to get others to do everything for you. Dabby Dabby must promise to keep that secret between him and Ricky. No one must know about Ricky being big scary cat. Okay, anyways, now I can be with ADD. Thank you, friends. Oh, yay. We completed who is bigger. Getting bigger. And also unlocked Ricky's cowardice skill branch. And we also got neural network. Something else as well. Uh, local hero, I believe. Uh, where is it? Somewhere. 
Oh, is it somewhere? If only I knew. If only I knew. Hmm. I guess helped helped people form an affinity for one another 100 times. Local heroes developed a five star affinity with the people of an area. Ooh, that means. Nice. We got five stars with Central Bionis. Amazing. Also, Ricky's cowardice skill tree improves block rate. Increases strength during the night. Increases agility when HP is at half. Reduces cooldown during the night. Increases accuracy of back attacks. And uh, increases XP rewarded during the night. Can I do anything with Ryan? Ryan. What's going on with you, Ryan? Uh. Ooh, that one. That quest, hmm. Well, now then. This one's kind of a long quest. This, this quest is actually a really long one, actually. Well, I need to find you first. Yes, indeed. And I also need to be playing as our boy, Ryan. Oh, yeah, baby! It's Ryan time. Yora and Ricky. There we go. You do not have any gem slots. That makes me very sad. Uh, but I need to find a Napon who goes. Sure, I just got experience there. Need to find a Napon who goes by the name of Hoko. Where is Hoko? Wait, 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 where is Hoko? Where, where, where is, where is Hoko? I have apparently never talked to Hoko. Which I am surprised about. Oh, hey, there's a video about Xenoblade 3 right there. Wow. Hey, it's that character. Oh, hey, it's that character. Oh, hey, it's those characters in the bath. Wonderful. Top housing level. Okay. Hey, it's that dude. Oh, it's that. It's the best character in the game. Oh, it's the best character in the game again. Hey, it's that person. Oh my god, this is very slow. It'd be easier if I had. Oh, it's those two characters. Uh, where is Hoko? Hoko. Ah, yes, I see. I see where Hoko is now. I'm being pushed and I don't like it. Hoko. Hoko. Is right over here, I think. But only during the day. That is not the change time. Where is Hoko? You're not here, I bet. Yes, you are. Hello. Hoko is so angry, he's going to burst. Hoko, leave village right now. Minos going to cook for no one in this smelly, nasty village. Hoko will start his own restaurant in another village. So, yeah, he's... Oh, yeah, that's right. He's in Xenoblade 2 as well. Hmm. Huh. If you have housing uh, level 2 and commerce level 2, you can invite uh, this very angry Napon to Colony 6. Yes, Hoko wants to go to Colony 6. Come on, friends, we go now. There are lots of different people in Colony 6 with Hoko's food. Hoko's food is going to make Colony 6 famous. We gain reconstruction and some population. I guess he brought, like, his sister or something. 
maybe his wifey pawn. So now we will head to Colony 6. Specifically to the Reconstruction HQ. Because he will actually have a quest for us. Uh, let's see. Ooh, what is Talonic here? I'm pretty sure Talonic is here. Uh, yes, because you need this tent to be completed. Hello. Hulk go in deep trouble right now. Hulk go hardly have time to think. Hulk go in trouble because Hulk go cooking a big bad storm. Customers get sick from his food. Customers never finish Hulk go's food and sometimes run away. Hulk go must beat other restaurant to survive our business die soon. Hulk go need better ingredients to beat wing headed Hulk cook. That's why friends are here to find Hulk go good ingredients. We need milk, liver, and meat. Thank you, friends. Now, Hoko's yucky slop become food fit for emperors and kings. Hurry back. No sweat. I believe the other sh the other cookie is trying to beat his talent. Eh? Don't ask me where he is, though, because I don't know. Ah, yes, right here. Is it you? Yes. What is it? One thing that surprised me even now is the mixture of cultures. They share food at the same table and exchange banter as friends. I feel pride at providing the venue where stranger bec strangers become friends. I suppose a restaurant kind of like this would be a place where people would make friends. And as we need... Fiach armor, armor milk. And you cannot trade for this item, unfortunately. I wish you could, but you can't. Took off counterattack. Uh, we need to go to the Bionis League. Somewhere in Bionis League. Gotta beat up all of these uh, Armu. I will spare you the time. I have acquired the milk. Now I need the the liver. These are a thing you get in Shrul Marsh. Probably should go here actually. Can you trade for these? The answer is yes. There is a person that we have spoken to before. So that means we don't have to beat up enemies. The one I speak of, of course, is Bokoko. We must. We must overtrade with him. Uh, what do you scent wood? What do I need that for? It's been a while. I'm gonna figure this out now. It is needed for Colony 6 reconstruction. And that quest. The a quest that I can't talk about. Well, it's the least expensive or it's the most expensive item, so. When is it? This is nice. You take this too. He goes up my brog liver. An item that we need. Um you take this as well. You take this as well. Final trade. Final item. Final. Final finale. Thank you! Now we shall head back to Colony 6. Back to the reconstruction. HQ. Now I must report back to Hokoko. Or Hoko. Hoko, Hoko. Hoko, Hoko, Hoko. How's it going, Hoko? Yeah. Oh, yeah, thank you, friends. Friends' ingredients are key to Hokoko, Hoko's new recipe. Fades to black. 
Wait, hold on, two seconds. What goes food tastes like food at last? Friends want to try. No, no, no freebies here. Friends want to pay like everyone else. Cheapskate. Silly Oko. Oko forget to say thank you. Here you go. I ah, thank you. Oko feel like cooking for all of Bionis. Nice. This is also good because I actually do need to uh, increase my affinity with this place. Oh, I can feel the strength. There is one person we need to talk to, though. There's a few people we need to talk to, actually. Uh, but I don't know where he is. Or if he's even here, actually, to be honest. The answer to that question is that he is not. Actually, I need to see if I if it is a smart idea to bring him here or not. And the answer to that question is yes. There is a person that we need to talk to in Frontier Village. I don't know if we've spoken to him before, but hey, now we're going to. I need to see where he is, actually. Where is he? I think I know where that is. I'm going based off of solely a picture and nothing else. I'm assuming he's in the central plaza. Uh, there is a chance that he might only come up during the night, though. Oh, hey, it's Noah. You're on Firelands! Oh, hey, it's that character. Is it you? Yes, you. Poka Poka! Poka Poka is a proud gourmet food critic with a tongue like no other. But Poka Poka's tasty skills are not really needed here in village. That's why Poka Poka want to move to Colony 6. Poka Poka hear that there are quite a few people there. Poka Poka just knows that there are lots of new treats to sample. Hey, it's Manana. Uh, let's see. If you want to invite Poka Poka to Colony 6, you must have housing level 2, and your population also must have at least 30 people. Yay, that's great! Poka Poka, what is food as he helps with reconstruction? Poka Poka, can we just search out rare foods and delights? Reconstruction plus 2, also population plus 2. Sick nasty. Now I must head back to Colony 6. Also, it should be noted that when, um... Poka Poka decides to move here, he doesn't come out during the night anymore. He comes out during the day. So if you want to talk to him, you're gonna have to change the time to... Daytime. Uh, yes, and he will be outside of Talonith's place. Talonith make delicious dishes. But Poka Poka wants him to push himself and cook sublime snacks. That is between, uh, 9 and 12. Both persons have filthy forks, have filthy forks, cruddy cups, and dirty dishes. They get things 10 points for effort. Hurry up with reconstruction so both cooks can, can buy new tools. Uh, yes, that was, that was the one that was between 9 and 12. So, we will change the time to 12. Yes. Wait a bit. Hello. Poco's food getting better. First he changes, first he changes ingredients, then he gets rid of bad taste. And I guess that's all he has to say. Let's see, after cook-off counter is... Uh, is McCrish here? I'm pretty sure McCrish is here. Oh, yeah, because over here he heads to, um... And he heads to... Uh, Hoko's... Place. Also, if you want to do the next quest, you need to invite Poka Poka and McCrish. Pretty sure McCrish is here. Is McCrish here? McCrish! Where is Makrish? Is Makrish here? I'm pretty sure Makrish is here. Makrish is not. 
I need to find you. Actually, if Macresha's not here, then that means I haven't done her whole side quest with, with uh, that other person as well. Man, I'm such a slacker. So lazy. How could I? Uh, she is... Yeah, she's not really a part of any quests at the moment. Or rather, here. Uh, yeah, all these quests occur in Colony 6. Makrish, I need to speak to you if you have... Let's see, what is it? Housing level 2, you can invite Makrish. Hi there. I think that everyone on Bionis can live together in harmony. From what I know of you, I'd say that you think the same too. I mean, could you help me find a place where everyone thinks, th thinks this way? Sure. Oh, thank you so much. I'm so glad I plucked up the courage to ask you. Even though I was the one who came to you, but... I was worried you might say no. Well, thank you anyway. Reconstruction plus two and population plus three. Enemies are attacking! Found out the attack. Oh man, reptile. Guess what? We gotta go beat up some monsters now. Because the ether planters are getting invaded. And this is important, trust me. Also, it's raining. Uh, where are these attacking enemies? Is the game not going to tell me? The game's not going to tell me. Let's see, they are right over there. Must go beat up uh, five lizards. Lizard people, excuse me. Yeah, these are level 37 enemies. For my level, they'll be a cinch. I think that's the proper use for that word. At least I hope it is, anyways. Come over each. Suck on this! Nice. Miora! Lariat! Now it's Roy time. Ooh, you know what I can do? Magnum Charge! Sword Drive! Bam! Double. Command Hammer Beach Bone Upper Wall Swing There we go Attack is over Drawing a crowd That's for inviting a specific amount of people to Colony 6 Now we could go talk to uh, What's her face Or what's his face But instead we're going to talk to okay. McCrush Oh, what can I do? Oh, it's you again. What is it? You're like a down in the dumps. Indeed. Thank you kindly. I must share something with you. I've always practiced acceptance of other cultures and people. That's why back in Alchemoth, I lived with a not fun boy. But one day he just up and left. I'm worried that he might get lost and hungry or worse. A ricky feel for a bird girl. It's not like good not fun little pond to run away from kind bird lady. You understand. Good. Let's not get sidetracked by me being correct. Yes, Ricky, sorry. What a good little thing you are. I've searched for him everywhere, you see, but I can't find him. Would you be so kind as to lend him a hand and uh, give me a hand in his research? Locate the missing Napo Rick. I'm truly grateful. His most striking character traits is that he's shy but, bit quite, but quite cheeky. He enjoys playing in grassy areas and goes by the name Napolrik. I gave him that name, by the way. Good luck, and I hope you find him good, find him safe. You gave him the name, okay? I'm pretty sure he had his own name, but whatever. 
as I've just seen, he is uh, over here in this field. Uh, yes. Jump the fence. Or oh, by this armor, we talk to this knuckle Rick. Oh, what? It'd be you guys. I never think anyone would discover that I moved here. Oh, well, can I do something for you? My crush be looking for me? You guys just don't stop helping people, does you? Well, I half expected she would come looking for me. I suppose I should visit her and say hello once in a while. And I'd be dying for a good meal. See you around the colony. So we get re we get some more reconstruction and population upon just talking to Napo Rick. He automatically moves in, it seems. Now I must talk to Makrish again before she runs away. You found Napa Rick for me! I thought I'd never get him back. How can I repay you? I don't know. I guess I should, I should expect nothing less from you, kind souls. After all, you're the ones who are rebuilding this colony for us. You're so nice! It won't be long before this colony is truly multicultural. I'm going to do my best to help it on its way as well. I mean, yeah, we've got Homs, Nopon, Hyantia. Could probably do with some Machna as well. Maybe. Who are you? Oh, you're Hoko. Well, I want it to be this time. Because if we actually talk to Talon, eh? Hello. What is it? I visited by Juju this week. He was kind enough to admit his cuisine, my cuisine, is better than Sharla's. Uh, of course, I do not know how good her cooking is, but I was grateful. Actually, no, I don't want to talk to you, I just realized. I want to talk to Makrish. Makrish, I guess she will be by Hoko's uh, restaurant. Hi there. Hello. Do you know Talonith? Everyone is quick to praise his talent and flair for food, but I just don't see it. I suppose not everyone is, is different, but I just they don't hate but don't hate me for my tastes. So she, Makrish, does not like Talonith's food. Uh, let's see. After that, we need to speak to our boy. Napa Rick, because he has a quest for us. I'm gonna finish this quest line first before we decide to talk to Hoko again. I cannot jump over the fence. This makes me sad. This is more. This is obviously more important than trying to stop Ego from destroying the Bionis. Yes, Mr. Napa Rick. Hello. Uh, let's see. Yes, there is two routes to this quest. Yes, indeed. All right. I feel like a moth flying head first into an ether lamp over and over. Please, 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 I need your help. What is it? I'm looking down at the dumps. Indeed. Now don't tell me you'll forget that great favor you did me. After you found me, I went back to say hello to her, and before I knows it, I'm back to square one and under her wings. She feed me awful food, my life be a living nightmare. She strokes and pats me nonstop and makes me sleep on her bed. Wish the worst bee I have is to carry shopping like park like pack armu. She treat me just like a servant. It bears it. I can't bear it anymore. Help me wins my freedom back. So, this quest has two endings. The first route is if we get the smelly perfume from the poison swamp. Or we can talk to Makrish. Man, I can't wait to do that scene in, Z in Xenoblade 3. Okay, my plan be simple. I need smelly perfume. If I smell so unbearably bad, she will not let me in the house. But you must keep this a secret. Do not tell Makrish. Well, I would, but unfortunately, the Monolith Soft uh, decided to give uh, Root B a green affinity. So instead, I'm going to go talk to Makrish and ruin your plan. Sorry, buddy. What's poppin'? Have you perchance seen Napa Rick? I can see from your face that you have. Tell me, please, what is he doing? 
Well, you see, he wants this perfume to make him smell like farts. So that's what Naparek is planning. Then I have a plan for him. Do you think you can get me some pure perfume? His scent is magnificent and completely opposite of his one. If you give that to Naparek, his plan will be foiled. So, we must get the pure perfume from the Great Magna Falls in the Magna Forest. That's right, we must head to Magna Forest to move my audio mixer. Sure, there we go. Looking for freedom. Ah, oh, yes, we must go to that place. It's important. Ooh, that kind of looks a little weird, actually. Hmm. Well, our goal is to head to this island. So it kind of looks like a shark right here. Mysterious three-finned shark. I'm going to cut out all this traveling because it's slow as balls. I have arrived here. There is the item orb right there. Big it up. And I must head back to Colony 6 and give this totally smelly perfume to Napolik. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, Napolik's gonna go inside now. Oh! Well. It's okay, we're gonna ambush him. We're gonna ambush him at the pass. Okay, well. <laughs> you see, you have what I need. Huh? Wait a minute, smell good. Hmm. If you're sure it will work, then I will use it. I should go as pamper myself up and put my plan into action. I will s I will soon be free. Make sure you go to see Makresh later on. She will need shoulder to cry on when she rejects me. Farewell and wish me luck. He disappears. Let's go to the HQ of the reconstruction variety. Let's talk to Makresh. Hi there. No, but Rick smells like nature intended. Thank you for handing him the wrong perfume. Now I can cuddle and snuggle with him forever and ever. I don't know what, what the bother is with living with different people. I believe that's it, that it's beautiful being harmonious with everyone. I mean, I wouldn't call that harmonious, but... Okay. I'm ever so happy. This is the best day ever. I have you people to thank for my happiness. I mean... I don't really know how I feel about this quest, because, I mean, she's treating a 20-year-old Nopon as a pet, but, I mean, whatever, I guess, to each their own. Not really. Also, where is... Actually, no, she's probably up here now that I think about it. Actually, do their things even move? I don't know if this is the case. Ah, oh, they do. Okay. There we go. Stop tracking. Now, time to do what we're actually supposed to do. Which is... Uh... Yes. Quick off. Come back. And we shall talk to... Hoko. Friends hear rumors about Hoko's yum yum food. It all because friends help. Hoko have many regulars now. Sick. Hoko need more. Cooking war still rage on. Can friends help Hoko get more juicy ingredients for restaurants? Hoko need choco legs, honey rhubarbs, and tropical radishes. You sure you're gonna win this thing with those ingredients? Hoko believe he can win. Hoko help me or or keep eating Hoko's small tasting snacks. Get moving, paper. I'm sick of his stuff as it is. I have only the rhubarb. This makes me sad. Well, 
Hoko right to ask friends. Friends mission for all of Colony, not just Hoko's pockets. I sincerely doubt that, but okay. Let's see, where can I get... Ooh! Hey, remember Talonith? I do. I was not targeting him. What is it? Is that you say a trade it is? Yes, because if he is in Colony 6, he gives us the quest item that we require. Till next time. Oh, he, does he not have a... What is it? Do you not have an overtrade for Colony 6? Oh, you do. It's just 17,000. I do want to show it off, though. Uh, not most recent. I want sale price. That's still not good enough. I don't want to get rid of, our, rid of my rainbow slug, so I'll give you this instead. Just to show it off. <laughs> well, we can hardly call this a fair exchange. Here, I insist you take this in return. He gives, it, he gives us the Dream Nasher. What is it? I sincerely doubt that this weapon is actually any good, but... I wanted to show it off anyways. Here, I have this melon. Melon! Uh, let's see. I have these tropical rations. These are from Earth Sea. Where can I trade them? Hmm. Ooh, an individual known as Recoth has them. Goth, come back. Let's see. Charcoal legs, honey rhubarbs, tropical radishes. Actually, you should see about this Dream Nasher. I bet it's probably garbage, but it is 100% garbage. All right. To not Earthsea, but to Alchemoth. We need to speak to Recall. We need to trade with Recall, rather. I fell off because I wasn't paying attention. Fell off because I wasn't paying attention. Uh, nope, that's not the right thing. Change the time. I thought they were here. Where are they? Um, Recoth, Re Kuth, eighteen to six. Oh, it's you two. I thought you were somebody else, but okay. Recoth, so you're here to trade. Yes, indeedy. I need your radishes, please. Thank you. Thank you, many. Oh, thanks for your jagged tail. How's things? I'll treasure it. Just kidding, I won't because it's not really all that great. What's that? Yes, I will give you my items. I am leaning away from the microphone. I'm not sure how this is going to come out in the recording, but I don't care. I mean, I do care, which is why I'm going to move back, but... What's that? Thank you! No, I must head back to what's-his-face. At least I think it's a V. I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell with Nopon. And I don't mean that in a racist way, I promise. This much, I promise. Daytime! I'm gonna speak to Hoko. That Nopon is running really fast. Going on, Hoko. Yeah. Amazing friends. Friends gather up great ingredients just like Hoko asked. Hoko was worried friends fail and Hoko's food get worse. Wait here and Hoko make something for friends to try. I'm waiting. With abated riff. Oh, tastes great. Hoko can never lose with all these scrummy, yummy ingredients, but Hoko have bad news. Friends don't get free food. 
Hoka wants friends to come back as paying customers. Knock on greed. Wonderful. Uh, now, at this point, we do not want to speak to Hoko anymore. We actually want to move over here. Oh yeah, after that quest, uh, we have... Nope, that's not right. Uh, Mr. Poco Poco gives us a new quest. Yes, indeed, he does. We're gonna talk to him first. Poco Poco is food critic and wants to try all foods of Bionis. That is why Poco Poco have a very important mission for friends. Molly, yes, sir. Poco Poco wants you to taste the hum's favorite bunya ham. Can friends find Ether Bunya and give me bunya ham? Poco Poco would get me himself, but bunya. Bunya are dangerous. Bunya always try to eat me. Someone should tell them it the other way around. Pretty please. Ricky not like Bunya either. Ricky not get not not like getting chomped. Why would Bunya eat you? Bunya gets sick from eating you. Bunya stay well away from you. Meh. Ricky tastes like fries, not on meat. Every monster wants to eat Ricky. So we need ham. Thank you, fellow food lovers. Poca Poca awaits your return. No sweat. Fantastic. Now I gotta go get ham. 